guys, welcome back to Struggleville YouTube channel. For this video, we're going to do a little tool haul. You know, I don't get to play with any of my new toys until we do this video, so there's not a ton of stuff, but what we lack in quantity, we more than make up for in quality. So, we're going to get right into it. First thing I got is this Dremel Stylo, versatile craft tool. 11 pieces, comes with a little stencil kit, and whatever that little snowflake thing is. So a little engraver there. It normally is $47.97. You can see it has a clearance tag of $35, but I actually only paid $25 for this. And it kind of depends on your Walmart. I can show you. On Walmart.com, it's still coming up $39.97, but if you tap at your store in Rockford, Illinois, it's coming up $25. I checked a couple of different zip codes and they are all coming up $25. So that's one good thing, when you're looking at a clearance section at Walmart, scan the barcodes with the Walmart app. Just Come on, work for me. We're live. Not live, but we're recording. I don't want to do it again. So, you see, you can just pull up. And sometimes, employees just haven't updated the stickers. So at one time it was $35 on clearance, and now it's all the way down to $25. So that's our first item. Next, we have an item from Vigru, King of Screw. So, this is one of our Amazon brands that we really like, so we found some good stuff from them. And this item, I only paid $14.79 after a promo code. It was posted on my website, struggleville.net. I really like the case that it came in, a little zip-up case, real sturdy and handy. See, it's a 19-piece file set. As we open it up, bam, look at all them. All sorts of files in different sizes, all in little elastic holders. Now obviously I'm just opening it up and you even got a little wire brush that they snuck in in the middle. Just opening it up so I can't tell you the quality of the items. But we've been really happy with the Vigru stuff. Posted tons of deals of theirs on the website. And most of it's a lot of hardware, replenishable type things. But I have high hopes for it because the other stuff has been real nice. I like the handle, it's pretty comfortable. I don't know, let's hope it's good. I really like the case though, it makes it real handy. So, we'll see how those go. For $14 though, man, that's cheap. Next, if you watch my Menards shopping video, these lights look just like... So I pulled one out of the package because I wanted to show you. This is the Quantum Pocket Light from Harbor Freight. If you don't have a coupon, they charge you $8 for one. At Menards, I paid 5 or $5.99 for three of them. And if we look... These things are basically identical. They're both magnetic on the bottom. So that's an amazing deal. Except for I got dead batteries. Oh, no I don't. These little damn tab things they put on things. I know it's good for it, but it screws me up. Bam! Terrific value. We love that. Next, another Menards item you guys saw. These, hey, they're magnetic. Magnetic paper towel holders after rebate. They're only $3.99 each at Menards. They look just like the U.S. General ones that Harbor Freight sells. Let me see what the Harbor Freight price is on them. So without a coupon, they're $12 at Harbor Freight. And we paid $3.99 after rebate. You got the three magnets there. A little dealy. I already have the Harbor Freight one. 
And I imagine it's the exact same tool. So I'm not sure where I'm going to put these two, but that was just too cheap to pass up. It's funny if you have them side by side, tool shop is upside down on one side. <laughs> I got two rights, no left! Now you guys saw me pick this up at Farm and Fleet just uh, the other day. It's $150. You can also get it at Home Depot. A couple other retailers all have it for the same price. But we have the M12 3/8 inch impact wrench. We also get the inflator. You're also getting this little mechanic kit, and you're getting a one and a half amp hour battery and charger. Again with the tool bag. So I had Blaine's bucks to spend, which means I was only out of pocket. It's like $63 for this. We're going to sell off a couple of pieces, but made it a great value for me. Let's open it up, check these things out real quick. has 30 of these damn bags between Milwaukee and DeWalt. Maybe it just has a problem. Maybe it means you just have a problem. We got the little flyer thing. Manual for the stuff. stuff. Here's our 1.5 battery. See the 3 8 impact. Let's see if we can get what the model number is. 2463-20. It is not brushless, but it'll still work for me. I have the DeWalt one too, so maybe we'll do a test. Let's see which one's better. Have our charger. Have 35 of these. That'll be for sale. The inflator will eventually be for sale, but now that I have probably seven or eight different inflators, maybe we'll do a video. It's hard to get out of the bag. To see which ones are the best. Have a DeWalt, Milwaukee, a couple of 12 volt plug in ones, HyperTough Walmart brand one. So we got some rubber grippies on the bottom. You can just feel it skipping around. Place for your battery. Couple accessories with the hose, handle, buttons, we know how those work. In the mechanic set, part of me really wants to keep the damn thing. I just, I don't need it. 12 piece, 3 inch socket set. Metric. Now I need it even less. Alright, cool. It comes with the... Jesus. Super grip on the elastic. Little 3 8 ratchet. And it's a roto head, flex head, swivel, whatever term you want to use. that the extension and it looks like we have a quarter inch adapter so then we have I've never actually owned any Milwaukee sockets kind of neat they're square there's your 10 Looks like they're all six-sided. And let's see, what do they include? 
10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 17, 18, and 19. We'll look it up. If it's not selling for much on eBay, I'll keep it. If it sells for, well, let's say, $30, which I don't know if it will or not, Milwaukee hand tools are kind of expensive, uh, then we're going to have to sell it because that's just too much for something I don't even need. Again, nice little case. Actually reminds you a lot of that Big Drew case. I'm officially in the Walmart Heart lineup of cordless tools, which I'm actually kind of excited for because I want to try them out. So Heart's new to Walmart, but it's not necessarily a new tool brand. They've been around a while. And I think it'd be kind of neat because it's going to be cheaper than a lot of the other stuff, but it might be really good quality still. Anyway, it'll be fun to test out. This was 55 I think, on clearance. Well, damn, I got my phone. Let's check. So you can see it's $54. It only shows up in store when I tried it um, on Walmart.com. They don't have it listed at all anymore. But $54, you're getting the inflator. You're getting the little spotlight. It comes with the battery, I believe, one and a half amp hour. And you also get the charger. Here's our inflator. Again, we have a little needle, a couple accessories for it. It's got the clamp-on style. I prefer the screw-on style, but... One thing I can tell you... Okay, got the screen on the back. I don't see a button, so I don't think you can set the PSI. I'm guessing it's just the trigger, and you watch the the back there. One thing I'll tell you right away is it's too big, man. My little Donald Trump hands can barely even get around this thing. Look, I just got the fingertips and I'm full gripping that sucker. <laughs> it's too fat. Here's the charger. A little slide-on charger. I think that's similar to what some of the DeWalt stuff uses I've seen in the past. Uh, let's see. Nothing too exciting there. Holy crap! <laughs> it's a little baby light! Look at how little cute this thing <laughs> ah, That's funny! Look how tiny this little guy is! Where's the battery at? We gotta try this thing. Big bulky battery for only being one and a half amp hour. So here's my DeWalt. That's a two. Eh, I guess they're kind of the same size. Just the body of it here feels bulkier. I guess they're pretty similar. It would be nice if they were universal. Use all my batteries and all my tools. All right, let's try this thing. Is it charging? Is there a battery? Oh, uh, no power indication on the battery. That sucks. It's on! On, off, no high, low. Kind of a clunky switch. Feels kind of cheapy and light, not real. But it's pretty bright. Well, we'll do a test on that. We got a bunch of lights now we can test out. The other heart item I picked up, which was what I was actually more interested in, the 10 inch buffer. Again, comes with the battery, comes with the charger, comes with the tool itself. This was, I believe, $39. Again, handy dandy Walmart app. We can, I'll get it eventually. There you go. $39. See so if we go to Walmart.com. 
5130, definitely don't want to do that. Like we get a couple of buffing pads. Dang, that thing's bigger than I thought it'd be. She's never said that. That's <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, kind of cool. On off switch. Battery mounts to the top. Got the big pad on the bottom. Now you know we gotta do this. Hold on. See, we got the same charger. And the same battery. Is this a bad idea? I think this is probably going to be a bad idea. Let's at least get my phone out of the way. I don't want to break that. It's already got a broke screen. Whee! <laughs> oh man, even got the dogs going now. <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for this tool haul. Let's back it up so we can see everything, kind of. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Give the video a like, subscribe, or a subscriber. We'll be back with more tool deals, tool hauls, some shopping videos. See you guys next time.